What's up, scrap gods? Uh, another day in paradise out here. It's like 50 degrees, a little overcast, but uh, I already got two scrap tips from my boy Chuck once again. Uh, he wants me to get that boiler out of there today, so that's what I'm gonna work on for the scrap life. And then he told me that there's some scrap in Longport a few, uh, about a mile from my house, so I'm about to go check that out right now. Uh, so we're just living the dream. Another day uh, living the scrap life for the boys. There's a little uh, AC unit that's worthy of the scrap life. And uh, TV, but I'm over TVs. I know how you guys love TVs, but I don't. That's the definition of a scrap god. Tailgate down. Truck from like the 90s. Fucking blue tinted like the ocean. That guy's a fucking legend. Fucking scrap everywhere, boys. <laughs> Too many scrap gods. Too little time. What's your synapses on the scrap life around uh, southern New Jersey? If you're not a scrap god, no point in living here. Then get the fuck out of my kitchen. Dude, this is the kind of shit I see around here. Heavy trash life. Dude, there's so much shit in here. Look at this, like, fucking... Toy tower, fucking, what is this? Java. This guy right here, gaming chair. This picture frame is kind of sick. Dude, used to have this rug when I was younger. Uh, little bit of scrap life right here. Aluminum thing. This picture frame. I kind of want this picture frame. Even though it's a little bit broken. I feel as though it can be used. Nice ass bucket for the scrap life. Can't be digging too deep into this shit, so that's pretty much it. Scored a couple nicies. A couple Barbie uh, Mickey Minnie Mouse pieces of metal to add to the dream. and driving it's camera and re video recording and driving what's up I, that's not illegal though <laughs> they didn't make a law because they had it like this all day long <laughs> you know what i mean like if they already made it a law like that i would have had at least 60 tickets <laughs> what's going on <laughs> what are you claiming i'm claiming I, I just got done in time and you're ready to go uh i'm about to try and take this thing apart and if i can't get it like that i'll call my other boy but i don't want to bother him if not you know oh, what i mean right. Beautiful day to pick up some scrap. My boy fucking Chuck, there he is. Meeting up with him. And uh, about to get this boiler out of this basement. This shit's, this is heavy scrap. Also heavy lifestyle, but um, yeah, we out here. So we're gonna hit the sash right now. Yeah. I was gonna cut the electric with the saws on this side. Let me check the tester. I would have got shocked. You would have maybe died. I have you done that stand. before? No, nah, not yet. But I would have had That's to, I had, bad, I had dude. You on standby to kick me off the juice, you know what I mean? Let me go open this door. Yeah, but I Oh, it opened now. What's your claim right now? My claim is this. This ain't coming out in one piece. Well. No, this will be good. No. Start oh. taking off piece by piece and we'll be in there. Oh. It's already cut. Chimney's disconnected. Electric uh, gas is plugged. I did that. A little scrap left over. So what should I do? Cut it from up top? No. Or right it's here? It's already done. Oh, you already cut it? Yeah. Oh, that. you're a god. Look, and I cut this. So, so what just, we can do... I can just take it all... Like, you see what I'm saying? I can take, like, piece by piece and just make well, it lighter yeah, for myself. We, we for everyone. Look. Do you cut, get what I'm saying? Cut it here again. Right? Cut it there. 
Cut it right here. Take the jacket off. Easy straight. Yeah. And get it down to the to the cast, which is a, a nice block. But you can cut all this down this way. It goes through the door easy. Just perfect. How much fun is this going to be? How fucked are we? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how Here's fucked are you? Part. How fucked are you? How <laughs> you? Yeah, I but I do this for fun. You do this for work. <laughs> but this is fun work. <laughs> Dude, this scrap life is so heavy. Look well, at how this. How are you going to get it through the window? How, you oh. can't. It's got to go that way. But yo, how, how uh, else would you get yourself in a situation like this if it wasn't for the scrap life? But how about this? How about the, how about the guy bringing his heater in when it was new? No, 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 no. Fuck that. We'll start scratching. Look, I left you a piece of copper. That's nice. <laughs> That's for the fucking squad, right? Yep. Yep. That's for the Christmas party. All right, let's get it. All right, here's what we got for the dream today, boys. Scrap life. Going to be taking off. Cut there. Cut here. And just take this thing apart in as many pieces as we can so it's easier to get out of here. <laughs> what are you claiming? I'm claiming I do this for fun. <laughs> it's called classic demo. Alright, I snatched off this piece right here. This big ass piece. So that's ready to go. What's your claim? <laughs> Here's the plan. Let's take this jacket off, get that bolt so this thing weighs three pounds. That's nice. Right here. And these things are already coming out. Yeah. Bolt. There's four bolts. One, one. Oh, no, nah, you know what? One on each it side, one start... here and one in the back. And then we we'll can, get to we it, yes. We can just split it right open. Perfect. But you got a hand sledge. Professional. Right. <laughs> the best on the East Coast. I thought a couple of these jokers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there it is. It's going. How is the dentist little guy now? Uh, hold on, no, no. Uh, time out. Oh, dude. That was the shot! And that was fucking for the boys, dude. Dude, this is for the subscribers. <laughs> yeah, this is for the, uh, <laughs> forget the, forget the three-quarter opening and wrench. We're going grinder. Try to do one section at a time. That's it right there, baby. Did you see that action shot? Yeah, I got it. That? I fucking got it. I wish I had slow mo on this thing. Holy shit, I can carry some white pinky. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> Another satisfied customer. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. Is that your last claim for the day? No, for the I, got, I got two claims upstairs. I got a sink whip hair and a tub drain. Where can you see that go down? Chuck Barron. Where's your YouTube channel? It's Chuck Barron now, Daddy. Okay, we're going to get a link to that. Chuck Barron. You'll yeah. be able to see him finish up on his channel later on. Maybe like this week coming up, he's going to upload it. So. Get on it. Yeah, it's, 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 it, we're networking here. I appreciate the plug. All right, here's what we got going on. 
Got the boiler, the hot water heater, cast iron, some a uh, tiny bit of aluminum, and I got a couple copper pipes, an air conditioner, the uh, dishwasher from Frankie, and that's pretty much it. A couple other extras on top, but yeah, we're heading, we're gonna head to the scrap here right now and see what we can get for this load and just live it. Scrap life. Scrapper's dream right here, boys. These little hugs, these are heavy, but uh, it's like one of them little freeze pops just in liquid form, pretty much. Nice day like today, though. Fire. Just what you needed. Time I go to the scrapyard, I go past this American flag. It reminds me of how beautiful it is to be living the American dream. Scrap life. Look, there's scrap right there on the side of the road. Can't even get it. I got too much already. Fucking scrap everywhere I look. Another beautiful day at the scrap yard. Here we are, another day in paradise. Got to cash in on some, uh, some scrap life. Just fully pop my tire over here at the scrap life. Hear it? It's just coming out like a motherfucker. Got to put the spare on in a minute after I get rid of this shit. All right, so I fully got a flat tire at the scrapyard here. Uh, got to change it out to the spare. No other choice. All right, well, this spare tire on my truck is fucking stuck under there. So I'm going to try to get it. If not, I'm in the right place because I can just buy one, but this just fucking sucks. This is how crazy this got. This is stuck, so I have to cut through that to get it off. And I have it jacked up because the wheel's just holding down on it. This is just a fucking mockery. Another shout out to the guys over here. He let me use this to fuck with it. Because he knew I was a donkey. But yeah, these guys are cool as shit. Helping me out again. One of the heaviest, one of the heaviest, heaviest scrap lifes I've been in. Uh, heaviest boiler into a pop tire into a broken fucking spare Donny thing that I had to cut off but yeah I made 68 bucks the light irons at six uh, six and a half cents per uh, pound and the cast iron is at almost eight uh, eight uh, cents a pound so all together I had 930 pounds and I fucking yeah, I I got like 70 bucks almost. I'm gonna have to pay like I don't know ten dollars for to fix this tire, but uh, I'm rolling now. So if you like what you saw in this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I got more scrap videos coming. I got more, I got tons of scrap videos on there already and other videos. And uh, please subscribe to Chuck's channel. I think it's just Chuck Barron, but I'll put a link at the end. And you can check that out. He does plumbing videos, uh, supping videos, and basketball videos. That's his main things. And he's got tons of videos on there. You can check them out. But he's going to upload what he was doing today at the job at some point. So we're doing like some cross collabing. And we're trying to get that guy to 100 subscribers at least, if not more. He's at like 60, I think, now. So please subscribe to his channel. Check out some of his videos. And uh, keep the dream alive. Another day in paradise. Come down here to the bay and wash off my hands from all that dirt. Look at this view though. The one thing about scrapping with a nice DSLR camera, can't be scared to ruin it. My shit's fucked up. Like, it's so dirty right now. But it doesn't matter because I'm living the fucking dream. Back at the shop. Just relaxing right now. Just kicking back at the fucking cribby. But yeah, I started pulling off on these pictures and shit. Pulled the back out of one. And it's like... There's another picture underneath. So it's like... The original drawing was not this. It was like a home painting 
and then this was behind it. And this is like a sick ass, like see through type Donnie, like put it up to the sun and you can see through it. I don't know. It's really cool though. And then it's like, what else is in here? You know? This is like the same shit, like someone like goes digging in the trash and they find like $20,000 or some shit. Like what do we got in here? Some old newspapers. And then just like, what is this? Oh shit, all right, this one wasn't hiding anything. Just some old newspapers. Picture and art trade. Some old books like that. Nothing special. Let's see what we got on. All right, so here's the final piece. Pretty much done. It's like four by three feet. It's got my uh, cut out of my friend from California, uh, Georgina, and then said, "Love is the answer." All records in the back, splatter painted and painted with spray paint. I think it's pretty. I think it turned out pretty sick. I'm into it. I'm happy with it. It's fire. So, moving on to the next piece, pretty much. Moving on to this. That's a pretty fire piece too. But yeah, this is like turning into a little art art gallery in here. I'm claiming. <laughs>